is it? 58. That's all citation. Yeah. Lot and Uncle were offered one of these in 1961 for free, and they didn't want it. That's how bad the reputation of the car was then. No way. Yeah. A lot of it had to do with the push button gear shift. They built them at the end of the shift in Ford and Mercury assembly plants, and the assembly line workers kind of sabotaged some of them. Now, wait a minute. Why would they specifically make it at the end of the shift? Um, well, I mean, was there a reason? Separate or? parts. Okay. You know, you're going to build 60 Fords an hour, and at the end of the shift, you're going to do five Mercury's or five Edsels. Yeah. I'll be damned. Yeah. Brakes work. Oh, yeah. Check that hood out. There's supposed to be a dash pad here. I have a new reproduction of it. I've put it in yet. Speedometer's neat too. Oh yeah. There's a good speed up for us. William Goodspeed is a place for his steamboats to dock on the way from Hartford to New York. And Hartford was parking their county trucks inside the building? Uh, East Adams would have been uh, snow plows inside that towards the, the end of its original life. The townspeople formed a committee to save it in 1959 and reopened in 63. Their specialty is 1920s uh, musicals. They'll do occasional new shows. Annie originated there, Manuel Mancha originated there, one or two others. And they own all the houses on this side of the street. That's all the housing for the actors. The brick buildings are the scenery shop, the costume shop. Good speed musical story. Get your original 1959 radio here. And the record player. Oh, there's a 45 player. Yep. Oh, 33 also. Yep. That works. Anymore. They're, they're quite effective. They sure are. 